Hello, I'm going to do a quick brain dump before we begin. And here's my room scan, patient, table here. Paper. Okay. Hello, my name is Jordan. I'm your student nurse today for pant hygiene. Provide for provide for privacy here. And I'll be going over there to wash my hands later, so I'm, I'll have to readjust my readjust my camera. All right. Hello. Can you please state your name and date of birth? When I, when I was oh, God. All right. Let me check your ID band. Great. That looks great. Um, do you have any known allergies? Sulfa, um, iodine, and latex. Awesome. Okay. I will note that down. Good. I am going to, so it looks like your doctor has put in an order today to kind of look at your abdomen, your bladder, and put it in a catheter because you're having trouble voiding. Does that sound right? All right. All right. And for this, I will be using um, PPE for this um, assessment procedure. And I'm going to raise the bed so that you're at a good height for my sterile technique, which will be at my waist level if it would go up. There we go. Great. I'm pretty tall, so he's going up kind of far. All right. So I'm going to leave these up for right now. And then I'll put them down when I perform. So next, I am going to um, take this down. And right now, um, we're just going to take a look at his abdomen. For privacy here. So I'm looking at the abdomen, looking for any abnormalities. Um, nothing looks like there's anything wrong with it. So now I'm going to go ahead and take a feel for it. All right, looks good. It feels non-tender. Abdomen's not descended. Um, uh, Joe, when's the last time uh, you um, voided? Okay, last time was this morning, so that's good. All right, so I'm going to put that down here. All right, so um, do you have any, let's see here, do you have a history? Do you have any history of catheterizations? No? Okay. Um, you're a male. Do you have any past gynecology um, procedures? If it was a female, they would tell me that. Um, and then the cognitive level, um, Joe is alert and oriented times four. So therefore he is um, able to take instructions and follow along as needed. Um, what else did I have here? Uh, Joe, do you have any joint mobility limitations? Okay. Nope, he does not. Um, um, I did my abdominal assessment. It's not tender. The abdomen's not descended. Um, right now, he is supine. He's in a comfortable position um, for um, putting in the catheter. Um, bed is up. So now um, I'm going to put on some gloves. Um, I'm just going to re-sanitize quick. Right. I'm going to put on some gloves and we're going, I'm just going to um, perform some peri care before we start. And I have some towels here. We're going to pretend for the case of this that they are wet and ready to go to be cleaned. 
All right, so I have three here, so I'm going to use, I'm going to put them here, nice wipe, this card, use one here, this card, and then get the penis and then the tip here, and underneath here, and lift up. All right, so I'll pull back down for to cover you up. And then next, um, um, performed hand eye. Okay, so I did the peri care. Um, the urethral meatus is right here. That's where we're going to be inserting. And for a female, it would be like the same. I would just point to it and you would be able to see it. Um, but for now, I'm just going to. Do that. Um, next, um, the trash bag is right there. Um, anesthetic ointment. Um, that is an ointment that we can put on to help numb down there um, if the patient wants it. Um, in this case, we don't have it. So um, now I'm going to take off my gloves here. Trash here. And then all my stuff here, get it lined up. Um, and all my equipment is clean and ready to be used, um, just so everyone is aware. Um, so for this, I'm going to go wash my hands over here by the sink. So I'm going to move this. So my hands are washed. My hands are properly washed. And I'm putting this back so you can see. So I performed hand hygiene. Now I'm going to you can see this. All right, so this is all properly set up. All right, so this is at waist level. Um, this is at my waist level here. All right, I'm going to take this down here. Just kind of hang this over his legs. So these don't really bend outwards. So just for the sake of this video, pretend that he's able to move outward a little bit. Um, so. Grab this. Start. All right. So to begin my sterile field. All right. Everything is ready to go. So now I'm going to begin opening up my kit here. And Joe, are you in a comfortable position? Is. All right, so I'm just going to take this out here, set that there, and this will be my trash for when. I'm throwing stuff away. So I'm just going to set that right there so it's easy to just maneuver without breaking sterile field. Okay, so now I'm going to, oh, and the integrity of the package was good, expiration date was good, so I'm able to use it. Um, my swabs here, my alcohol swabs are good, ready to use, package is good. I'm just going to set that over there. 
All right, now I'm opening up my package here. And it's going to turn this here. Okay, so these are my gloves here. I'm just going to set them off to the side, nice and gently, not breaking the sterile field, um, making sure my corners only touching the outside corners here. And this I'm grabbing. It looks like I just broke sterile field, but I didn't. Um, for this, I'm going to grab the corner here and lift it up. Step back. And then grab right here. And then here. And then this is the shiny side facing me. So I'm going to step right here and lay it down like so, just like that. And my hands are not going below my waist. Next, um, let me see. All right, so now this is my drape. So I'm picking from the corner, not breaking sterile field. I'm only grabbing the corners here. I'm lifting up, taking a step back. Going like this. And then I am placing this. Over Joe. So, make sure I'm doing this right. So I would go away from them. Okay. Got my corner here. And I'm touching here. And I broke sterile field by going like this, but now I'm up. I acknowledged it. I will not do it again. All right. So now I am grabbing this. Not using this because he's allergic to iodine. I'm setting that here. And now I am able to let me see here. Now I'm able to put on my gloves. Probably in the outside corner here. I'm grabbing this. I'm just going to open these up and get them ready here. Okay, I'm just going to set this right here. Okay, and now I'm going to put on my gloves. So, here. Like this, under the cup here. And put them on like this, like so. Now I am sterile. So I'm just going to take this off. I'm going to set this down here. So this is all sterile. Uh, this I'll just set here, and I'm moving that out of the way because I'm not going to use it. Taking the cup and just setting it down. How you doing, Joe? Good. So now, 
for this. I'm going to, all right, hold on, let me think here. Sorry, give me a second. Sorry, I'm just trying to think if I forgot anything. Um, so I'm just going to set this here. I'm going to take this off, pull that down, and I'm going to set this in here, throw that away, don't need it. All right, and I'm going to put this back here. I'm going to grab this, dispose of the cap, and then I'm putting this right here. Now I am going to reach inside here, grab. Like this, nice and easy. And then I will grab this. So for this, I'm just gonna step right back in there. I just broke stereo field by reaching across. Um, so for this, I am losing, I'm not going to be sterile now, because I'm going to be cleaning with this hand. So, one rub here, trash that, another one here, good, and now on the middle, you want to make sure you get it nice and clean. All right, drop that. Now I'm going to take this out and I'm going to. So for this, um, since he is a male, I'm going to um, insert it two inches once the urine is obtained and um, Use, make it to the Y for vacation in males. So. And then, all right, so now it's good here. I would then take this, make sure that it's, now I'm gonna push it all in. All right, and then I would tug on it to make sure that it's in there good, that the balloon worked, and it is. So, um, therefore, um, my sterile technique is now done. So I'm going to now let go. Um, I am going to remove my gloves here. So, oop, I broke sterile field by dropping it below my waist. So, hands are up. Um, I did reach across earlier and I broke sterile field there, so I wouldn't do that. Um, so now, um, um, I would then move the catheter to the inner thigh here to have it placed there. So right there. Um, and then the steps to maintaining sterility, I would don um, the procedure gloves, um, empty the tube, clamp down, clamp drain tube below um, down here. 15 to 30 minutes, um, remove contaminated gloves and perform hand hygiene, which I still have to go do to perform hand hygiene. Um, insert 
the needless access device with using a 10 ml syringe, transfer the specimen um, into this cup right here, and then um, discard the needless device and clamp the container, remove the clamp, label the package, and then take it to the lab. Um, so I'm gonna uh, step away and wash my hands. And I would do a full 20 seconds for hand hygiene to make sure I did it right. All right, so I remove gloves, discard all supplies. Um, I would then um, then wipe off the excess um, lube, anything excess lubrication on the patient at the end here. And that was obviously I do that before um, I washed my hands and got all clean again. Um, so I'd wipe the peri area, um, perform hand hygiene, and uh, get rid of all this stuff, clean and re-sanitize everything and make sure Joe is doing okay. And Joe, are you doing okay? Are you still comfortable? Perfect. Okay. Um, if you have any questions at all, please feel free to call us. Um, yeah, I think that's it. Um, if it was, if I was doing a female, um, it would be five to seven point seven and a half centimeters for um, insertion of the catheter, and then another, and then an additional one to two. I think it's one to two inches um, once it's in there. Um, and then the drainage bag, I would then position at the side of the leg here, um, at the inner thigh. And then um, um, I did break ster um, sterile field. And I stated it. Um, I always go like this, never like this. And then keeping my hands up over my waist. Uh, same with this. Um, don't turn my back on the patient. And yep. And then I put my trash in here. Okay, that is the end of my video. Um, here's your uh, lower the bed. Um, give you your call light. Um, clear the pathway um, so no falls. Um, I would wipe down all of my tools, supplies, kit. Um, bed rails are all okay. The side rail would go down. The bed is locked and ready to go. Um, do you have any more questions for me? I have time. Nope. Okay. I will come in and check on in the, on you in a little bit. Okay. All right.